welcome back to my channel just coming on to open up this vlog today is friday june 16th and your girl is headed to work um late it's 9 20 right now i have to take Jaden, my youngest son to the airport this morning because he's going to atlanta with his job for the next week so i had to come in to work a little late but i'm so glad today is friday yesterday was so lit um we went <laughs> i feel crazy saying that it was so but it was it really was um we went on the boat yesterday evening for uh something to do to congratulate my daughter for her eighth grade graduation and so it was my me and my family her dad his family well some of his family um and we had a good time uh they had all you can eat tacos and um we had margaritas it was it was a nice it was a nice vibe and a nice time um let's see and this vlog will include um my daughter's graduation her eighth grade graduation what we did afterwards the day the next day um we took a cruise on a boat um, in honor of celebrating her graduation and I don't know what else so just stay tuned and um, watch the video to the end and I'll see you guys in the next clip it is Wednesday morning and I am on my way to my daughter's graduation it's me and Javen <laughs> and we on our way to Marlena's 8th grade graduation I got on my proud mom shirt it says proud, super proud mom of an 8th grade graduate and um, her dad has a matching shirt that says super proud dad um, but yeah so I'll just see y'all when we get inside a few moments later
These three simple yet powerful principles have guided you every step of the way, helping you develop into outstanding individuals and possibly one of the best eighth grade classes to walk these halls. You have demonstrated the importance of being on time, showing up, prepared, and ready to learn, and respecting the value of every moment and opportunity that comes your way. With guidance from your incredible teachers, you have exemplified what it means to be on task, channeling your energy and intellect toward your studies, extracurricular activities, and personal growth. And most impressively, you have embraced being on a mission, discovering your passions, setting goals, and working tirelessly to achieve them. As you prepare to embark on the next chapter of your educational journey, always remember the lessons you have learned within these walls. Continue to embody the spirit of the cougar, harnessing your strength, agility, and determination to overcome any challenges that may come your way. Eighth graders, see the future with enthusiasm and hunger for knowledge. As you enter high school, take every opportunity to expand your horizons explore new interests, and dare to make a positive impact on the world around you. Okay. Here's the right now. You're surrounded by your loved ones in all that we can wear as you create a brand new chapter in the story that's yours today. We talked about memories you have yet to make together in the moments you brought to share to the charity you serve. So take the time to life today as your high school is going to be here. Look around and so feel at the moment we are here. So again, here is to the future that is bright and warm and clear. For more than that, here is to right now and we're going to be Yeah. 
something fresh and green. You owe it to yourself to make your days your count. Have fun, dig, stretch, dream big. Know though that things are going to show them from you. Those good days, those good days, and those bad days. Those days we want to come around, pack up and call you. Those times tell you that you are pushing yourself, that you are not afraid to learn by trying. Persist, because it's not easy. Determination and the right to do is a great thing. But your instincts, your intellect, and your heart guides you. Instead of making excuses, I decided to make progress. So I challenge you, when you get to high school and college, all of the things that are thrown at you, the challenges when you don't feel well, you, you lose a loved one, don't allow those things to stop you from making progress. So I leave you with that. At this point, eighth graders, if you would please stand. <laughs> We are transitioning from eighth grade to high school. After I'm finished, we're gonna leave the aisles open so that they can march out. I challenge you to make progress in high school. Don't give up. There is no reason for you not to make it. I don't care what your parents did. Both of my parents dropped out of high school. Out of seven children, I'm the only one to finish, high, finish college, actually. Don't allow anything to stop you. At this point, please move your tassels from the right to the left. You are officially ninth graders. educated and graduated. You happy? Did you cry? No. 
Yeah, I was finna crack because Apple started crying. Aw, did she? Yeah, she was crying hard. Aw. <laughs> you got your flowers and your beer. <laughs> All right. So it is after graduation, and we are at what we call the um, swing park. Um, it's this park area with um, a bridge with water and rocks and stuff. And um, they're taking pictures. After that, she's going over her friend Apple House. And then after that, um, she's going out to eat with her granny. Yeah, I know I need my nails done. She's going out to eat with her granny um, to, I think, Laughing Crab is where they're going. And then after that, tomorrow is when I'll be celebrating with her. We're going on a boat cruise so uh, with the family. So I'll also capture that, and that will be included in this vlog. So I'm so proud of my baby. Uh, congratulations, Lena. Um She's been at this school since K-4. K-4 all the way through 8th grade. That's a long time to be at one school. And, um, I mean, we had little hiccups here and there, but never, like, any big issues. So, I can say that Cash Street did us good. Um... I can now say the name of our school. Um, my other kids went there as well. And um, now off to high school. And so, um, yeah, today is bittersweet because, like I said, my other kids went here too. So there will be no reason for me to go to cast no more. Um, and so, yeah. So I'll talk to you guys later.